Okay, question time. Can we use additional LAN ports at the back of your NAS as a switch? So if you connect your uh, Ethernet or Internet to your LAN uh, and have additional two or three LAN ports, can we uh, connect the PC to this additional port and have this Internet transferred through the Synology NAS or QNAP NAS to a um, PC? And the answer is, with Synology, you cannot do that. You can do that only with a QNAP. On Synology, you can use the additional LAN ports either for uh, load, load balancing, that means if you connect all those four LAN ports, then uh, if you have four uh, other users in your network, they can connect with um, one gigabit uh, speed. So you don't need to share this one gigabit connection among these four people. A second option would be load balancing. So instead of having one gigabit, you merge all these four LAN ports together and you get four gigabit um, uh, LAN connection. On, uh, you also need, in that case, a managed switch, like from Netgear. And also, on a, in a receiving device, so on the computer, you will need either 5 gigabit or 10 gigabit, uh, or link aggregated for LAN ports again. In that case, you can increase the speed between your NAS and your computer. And the third option would be uh, as a failover. So, if one LAN port, like LAN port burns out, something happens, disconnected, he automatically switches to a second one, so you don't have you have uninterrupted service uh, from your NAS. Th these are the only three options you can use on Snorgy. QNAP will also allow you to use um, uh, as a, this LAN port as a virtual switch. So you connect your Ethernet to your um, uh, NAS, and uh, you can connect additional computers to your NAS, so they can actually share the Ethernet and internet. That's the only thing you can do with um, QNAP. But um, if you do want it on a Synology, then I would recommend getting a really cheap one gigabit switch. So when your incoming connection is to your computer, you connect switch to that. And then from that switch, you connect to your NAS, to your computer, to a printer, whatever you wanted to connect. That's the way it works. I hope Synology follows um, what QNAP is doing and creates this virtual switch option. But at this point, only QNAP is doing that. I hope this was helpful. And if you have any other questions, you can always uh, shoot the email to info and ask bears or fill the form on the right hand side. If the question will be interesting, we're going to shoot video like this so we can help the world. Cheerio.